the energy vibration reading for the um, second week of um, November 2017 for the Taurus and Moon and Rising. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for this wonderful, wonderful support. Welcome all newcomers. And um, please remember to listen to your Sun, Moon and Rising sign. And um, um, thumbs up these videos and uh, thank you so much for um, supporting my channel don't worry about my hair I'm okay it has just been a busy week and I'm trying to get these off before I go to bed so you Taurus Wow okay all right okay you Taurus is this is going to be good for you guys so let's see what is going to be the focus of your week oh my god <laughs> okay 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 all right um the week is uh, the week of hair it is the zodiac energy of water hair and water but this is um, the focus of your week, which is the night of uh, um, the night of ones, and the energy of the night of ones is um, your passion. Your passion is coming out. You're going to feel the energy as if you know you're young and just ready for the world and that sort of a thing. So this seems to be a wonderful, good week. We also have. Um, a positive energy of the ten of pentacles coming out also so this is going to be good so let's look at your week and see what is happening we have a, a fire sign on Monday we have the star on Tuesday Tuesday seems to be a very good very very good um, day for a lot of people and Thursday you have the energy of the hangman in as your focus so a lot of people are going to be getting dreams so this card bring the energy vibration of a lot of people connecting with your spirit guides and going to be um, receiving messages via your dream the lovers is here on Thursday which is the water sign which is good and on Friday the king of cups is here the king of cups has been coming up and helping a lot of people in this week and we have the two the two of star so new doors new opportunities are going to be opening up for you and you have another night of swords okay so the knight of swords is posi positioned under the lovers so some of you are going to be having relationship with these air sign people which is Aquarius Gemini or Libra so be aware of this um, the way your week is looking is as if you're ready for a battle you're ready to go in to war and you're going to win this whatever you're planning on doing um, the energy on Tuesday is a yes energy go for it Monday and Tuesday is going to be your two best days Monday and Tuesday okay so let's look and ask the angels what are the messages do they have for the Taurus for the second week of November magician the devil but yet still the star comes out this is good oh gosh the pages have been coming up for a lot of sign in this week the pages have been coming up you need to rest and on Sunday you have the energy of the burden and you need to protect yourself so whatever is happening protect yourself from this energy of this night this night of ones protect yourself from this energy of this night of ones okay whatever is happening someone who is a, um, a Aries um, Aries Leo or Sagittarius protect yourself from them okay first let us see what um, is your energy of vibration number the pages a lot of messages are coming through um, the, the, you know there's a page that is coming um, with the lovers there is someone that is intervening in your relationship there, there is, is a, someone that is intervening in your relationship so be aware of this person because someone is intervening in your relationship okay 
this person is, is trying to make some mischief or that sort of a thing so someone is intervening in your relationship the numbers that are here the seven um, the seven the seven or here which is good so number seven is going to be your energy vibration as we look at Monday a wonderful day it is a day of victory and success and it is a wonderful positive day for some people for some people it's going to be a day that you decide you know you have all that it takes and you're going for it and whatever has happened and will happen you're going for it because you are going to go the distance okay some people are going to go in war some people are going to be victorious and some people are going to go in, in war some people are going to move with ambition and move um, on because you know that you have it to be a success and you should not let anyone keep you back on Tuesday which you know I haven't seen this in a long time we have the energy of the devil but you are the star so whatever this whoever what was trying to do something you end up to be the star because there's a lot of time that people try to pull you down and make you look bad and that sort of a thing but you still end up to be the star because there are so many things because you never can keep a good person down it is always always a saying an English saying you never can keep a good person down so whoever that was trying um, to make you look bad and place you in a bad light they are now you know the devil and you are the star because you are the person that is working with such an eye energy vibration that whatsoever that person come with or whoever those situation or people are it's not going to affect you at all okay so let's look at what's happening in the middle of the week the middle of the week and this week it's going to be a week where a lot of messages are going to come in via the dream state okay and this information that is going to come in is all the deception and lies you're going to receive the truth about all the deception and lies whatever the deceptions and lie was you're going to receive the truth the truth is going to come out and whatever the deception and the lies were and this sort of a thing you're going to be seeing everything that will be coming in your dream state on Thursday you have a situation with the lovers and be aware for people who are in relationship long-term relationship and that sort of a thing be aware of this person because someone is coming to make mischief in your relationship this person is very mischievous it's not someone who is coming is someone who's using um, a sort of an energy to make mischief in your relationship to you know in your in your you know and you're seeing someone and this person is trying to make mischief so be aware of this situation because this person that is coming in I'm going to look at who is this person and why is this person doing this and what's the what is the reason why this person is doing this because you know sometimes people yeah who, this person is coming from overseas um, to make mischief but it's going to be okay it's gonna be okay not to worry it's going to be okay because what is happening is that uh, um, this person whoever this person is this you know it's not really a nice person and you're seeing this coming out because what you're going to realize is that this person comes to make mischief in you know all different forms and it, 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 it is someone who maybe some of you have to do business with um, and this person you know some of you are going to go on a long journey some of you are going to be you know going on journeys going on cruise maybe you you have gone on a cruise and someone is going to want to intervene in your relationship or someone is going to want to tell your partner something and this you know I'm this sort of a person whenever people come to tell me things I always ask them and what was what did you say 
so you know whoever is coming in whatever is happening still try to enjoy your life because and relax and you know whatever the situation is um, there are always people that is trying to intervene in your relationship there's always people who just are not happy because they're not happy in a relationship so be aware of that on Friday you have the energy of a Pisces a cancer or a scorpion and they're bringing love to you it is uh, the situation where this is the can the energy of a child that is saying you know um, I love you or this energy is a situation that this person is coming up especially for the women um, this man could be coming up and saying you know I really love you I care about you and you know I want to bring it to the next level so on Friday it's going to be good if you get an invitation out go because it's going to be a good invitation because someone wants to connect with you on Saturday it is the two of one this is good uh, some people may might be hearing a message that you know a job offering is open and it's good take rest on Saturday you need the rest you have to take rest you really really need to rest so take rest on Saturday because it's very important for you to rest and when you rest and you connect some people who are on the fourth dimension is going to um, start um, us to travel and that sort of a thing and this is a very good on Sunday you have the energy vibration of the Knight of Swords and a burden that this Knight of Swords is bringing on you so whoever you are out there you're an earth sign and these night people they come with all different sorts of a thing and you know borders some things and you feel as if this person is bringing so much burden on you that you're thinking oh my god you know what's wrong with you what have I done let me think about how can I heal the situation so this is someone who is an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra that is a burdensome you know he's you know the conversation and that sort of a thing and you're wondering you know do I really need to go um, go, <laughs> go with this so let's see what is this burden that you're carrying for this person because if it's a relationship um, if it's a relationship yeah it's a you need to move away from this person um, and moving away from this person is going to make you very very happy so whoever this um, this Aquarian um, Gemini or Sagittarius person is as you move away from this person you are going to feel much better within yourself and you're going to be able to cope with yourself and there's going to be a little luck that is coming your way because a transition is going to be happening and this transition is going to be good because this transition is going to bring in a wonderful wonderful um, and better situation for you so you know this this is positive in the sense that this um, it's gonna you know bring positive changes and improvement in your life so this is positive so Sunday it's going to be a very good day on Sunday um, even though the burden and this person is coming because you hear people they just you know they go they just tell you exactly how it is and don't really care how you feel and um, this what you're doing to do is just you know sit and listen to the message I've always said to people just sit and listen to the message and um, as you sit and listen to the message you don't really have to say anything just say thank you after they're finished some people find it to be rude and I find it to be just a way to deal with less chaos okay so as we break your week down and we look for the energy of love is going to be very strong very powerful in this week because whatever is happening some people are going to be having um, connection with people from overseas and this is going to be extremely good so you have nothing to worry about this is going to be positive so 
remember that a lot of you will be receiving dream um, information via the dream time maybe sometimes you wake up and you're not aware of it and you uh, you know it's hard for you to remember what is happening but it's going to be good you need to rest they're asking you to rest so if you normally um, get up through the week and you work a nine-to-five job they are saying to you take some rest you need to have some rest and when you get that rest and you feel better you, you know you can make a lot of things happen so let's look and see what the Oracle is saying for you guys and it says the truth be told the truth be told and this is good I love when the energy of the truth be told comes up because obviously some truth is going to be told and uh, sometimes we are afraid to tell people the truth and what they're saying now is that you should just tell it as it is so honesty accepting things at face value coming out of denial and the willingness to be transparent clarity of communication and this is so so good ladies and gentlemen this has been a wonderful um, reading it is a positive week love is coming in some of you women are going to be connecting with air sign people um, with water sign people new love is coming in for a lot of you people out there so this is going to be wonderful this is going to be positive and for the rest of what is happening it's going to be extremely a positive week I want to say namaste until next week yeah.